We begin with changes at Harding Jefferson ISD. Tonight, board members voted on a new policy to allow community members to share their input before a school or building is named. The district faced criticism after it changed the name of Henderson Middle School earlier this year. Yeah, it was named after the school's first black principal, this man, Mr. J.H. Henderson. Some community members felt like the name change erased part of their history. Moving forward, people will have more of a say. Good evening to you. I'm Jordan Williams. And I'm Brenda Matuti. 12 News reporter Gloria Walker was there as board members passed a new policy tonight. Gloria, what does this mean for the naming of schools in the future? Well, Brenda Jordan, this new policy will require a community-led committee to review any future school renamings or name applications. The board says this is an effort to ensure everyone gets a say. Tensions were high at the Hardin Jefferson ISD school board meeting tonight. Community members like Beverly Walters voiced their disapproval at the board's decision to rename the Henderson Middle School. It's a disgrace yes. to us, mm -hmm. to the community, yes. for five white men and one white woman who's no longer on the board mm -hmm. to decide upon themselves to take Henderson name down. Tonight, the board approved a new naming policy that would offer the community a chance to give their input on naming future facilities. Policy is to have an avenue for any recommendation to come to the board for any facility or part of a facility for renaming. Okay, so no option has been removed. Just for that clarification. School board president Andrew Brooks says several steps would need to be taken before a new name is chosen for any district building. New where community uh, and can submit input to the district. Uh, the, su the superintendent can then bring that to the board, and the board can then create a committee, a community apprised of community members, up to two board members, an administrator from campuses and district personnel. Um, and then that committee would meet, form, you know, discuss, make recommendations. With the policy now in effect, former students of J.H. Henderson, Claudia Tyler, hope to keep the Henderson legacy alive. She suggests changing the name of China Elementary. He's, we started there. So why not take him back there? The, the, his street name is there, so why not drive up to the school? Come off of Henderson and drive into Henderson. While there's a new policy in place, community members tell us their fight is far from over. We're not going to stop fighting. If it takes us to come down here every month and, and to do whatever we have to do to make, to make a change, we're, we're prepared to do it. Now, there was no indication tonight that Henderson Middle School will keep its name. However, because of this policy, the Henderson name could be featured on a future building. In studio, Glory Walker, 12 News.